back to Keeping Up with Miss Electra, and today I have a haul from Home Goods, and it's all farmhouse decor. You guys are gonna really, really love it. These are two trips I made. I picked these up. It wasn't one trip, and I think you guys are gonna really, really love the pieces that I found in Home Goods, and I'm excited to show you guys. And all of these are again for the living room. So I just want to get things for the living room so then I can start um, decorating with you guys. So I think it's going to be really fun. And I picked one or two for the kitchen. I can't help myself either. That's why I'm, I'm trying to do this. Um, that's why I did this series is to help myself too because we don't stay focused on um, one project. So I feel like I can help someone by me you know expressing and showing and telling that we'll stick to one room and yeah so that's why i created it not just for you guys for me too because i tend to do that because you see you like to buy you know all different kind of stuff but i think we should stay focused on one room get this room done and then move on you know like get one room feel happy about the room and then we can move on and it doesn't have to be all in a month it could be two months three months four months five months even six months but at least we did one room you know at a time and i buy stuff random and then we play stuff and we're like okay it doesn't even feel farmhouse ish is because we spent money on other rooms and we didn't you know focus on our plan so I'm bad with that too, and that's why I know, created this so I can be accountable for this. You know what I mean? It's like I I try to, I buy other things. I'm like, nope, I gotta buy that because I told everyone, and I gotta stick to my plan. So yeah, so it's helping me, guys, because I would be like, oh, let me get something for my bedroom. Let me get sheets. You know, you go into Home Goods. You want to get, you know, other things for other parts of your room, like bathroom and that. But we're not, right, guys? We're sticking to family room, living room, or whatever room you picked. If you pick the kitchen and if you picked your bathroom and you want to pick a smaller place to start, that's fine, too. We're going to talk about that, too. You could start with a smaller space and, you know, but we'll talk about in the series when I start the series. We don't have to talk about it right now. Right now, I'm going to show you the things that I picked up from Home Goods, and I know that's what you guys want to see. So let's get into the video, and let me do this quick because it's a lot of stuff. <laughs> I think it is. I, I wish you were here just to see. Right. So I think I should start with. Um, I think we should just get over it. These. <laughs> well, I'll just start with this. It's not important. And it's like wooden um, spoons, and they were a good price. They were only $3.99, so that's why I picked it up. And because, you know, we're transitioning to like country. So, yeah. And then I picked this up. I wrote this. It didn't have, and I'm trying to take it off. If anybody, you know, knows what to do to remove this, you know, I'm going to Google it too to remove the, um, the chalk marker. So I know I think there's a way, but I, just, I know there's a way. So if anybody knows, just let me know down below because I just want to change it. I wanted to write something and I didn't want it to be permanent, but whatever. It's not that bad. It says Farm Fresh. So, And it's uh, kind of like, um, I don't know, reminds me of a wine jug, but it's a jug. I just think it's so adorable. It has a cork um, lid. And it was only $5.99. And I don't know if you can use it, if it's food safe. It doesn't say, but I think it is because, I don't know. But I think it's cute. You could put flowers in here. You could do whatever you want. You could write spring on here. You know, any season. So I like this. I thought this was cute. You could even turn it around and put flowers and not even show the label. So, yeah. yeah let's just do the little stuff really quick. And then I found these, these are coasters. I threw the box, but I thought they weren't coasters, what I thought because I didn't read, you always have to read. But I didn't read the box and I assumed, because that's what I was really looking for, I'm looking for block, you know, words. And I thought this was wood and it was just, you know, um, chalk painted. But it wasn't, it is little coasters, but it's cute too. And I like it because, you know, it's Scrabble tiles, I guess. So it spells out home and, you know, you place it on your coffee table and it protects the, you know, from hot stuff. 
So this is really, really cute. I don't want to break it because they're slate. I threw the box away. So this is cute. You just lean it on your table and you can even like spell it out to home because it's really, really cute. And I think they're breakable because they're slate. I'm not sure, but I like them. They're really cute. My kids always play with this. They spell it out. So they're like, oh, you should have got more letters. I go, they didn't have. It's not a game. It's for drinks, I told them. So, and then I picked up these wood pieces. They're not coasters. I thought they were coasters. That I thought was a block, you know, it's spelled at home. I was going to put it on my fireplace, but it's coasters. But anyway, this I thought were coasters, and they're not. They're just like um, wood pieces for decor, I think. If you know better, let me know. So you could even like place a candle on here or anything. I love these. I got two of these. So these are cute. You can like put them in your decor, put on your coffee table. Yes, I think this is more like a decor piece, I think. All right. So and then I picked these candles since I lifted it. But they're like little mason jars and they had black lids, which I can't find them, which I'm getting really upset. I looked all over because it looked really cute with the black lids on top. But I got two of them and they smell so, so good. And I like them because they look, you know, like farmhouse vintage. And they really, really smell really good. So, yeah, but I just gotta find the lids. So just picture the black lids on the on these. And they're so cute. I lit them already. And they smell so, so good. And these were a little expensive. I think these were like $6 each. So it's a little pricey. I think. All right. And the little pig. How cute is this pig? I just love him. He's $7.99. I could put this in my family room. And if I don't, I could put him somewhere else. But that's where I want to put him. You know, and my candles are for my family room too. And I wanted to show you guys this tray. I just love this tray. This tray was $12.99. But this is so vintagey. I just love it. It's like, you know, um, the enamel like bowls and stuff it has that look it's a little distressed I just love this and it came even bigger but I didn't get the big big one because I was like maybe I'll put it in my kitchen and my kitchen doesn't have such a big big table if I had a big big table I would get the big one too so and they're a good price they're wooden handles I just love that I hope you guys can see so yeah it's like the enamel bowls you know like dish pans and that from years ago like the vintage ones so it reminds me of this, so that's why I picked it up. And it's like the, the summer edition for home goods. So that was a good find. I really love these. I, this is like um, kind of like industrial, but you can add industrial to country and French country and all that. You can incorporate it, so that, that's why it's so fun and I just love it. So it's two bookends. How cute. I just love it. I would love to get shelves you know, with these, um, these pipes. So love this. This is going into the family room, the living room, whatever. And I was just a little sad because it didn't come as a set. So yeah, so I was a little bummed. It was $12.99 each. You know, I asked the lady, she's like, no, they're separate. So I guess you could just get one and just, you know, just for decor. You don't have to get two, but I got two because I'm thinking of putting a book in the middle. If not, I can just, you know, set them aside or, you know, this way on the side. So you can do a lot. You know, with the farmhouse and all this vintage stuff, you can, like, have so much fun and just place things, like, randomly. And, you know, they look good. So, yeah. <laughs> then, okay. Let me show you this big um, glass vase. It's kind of reminding me, like, of the Demijohn... Um, glass you know vases those vintage ones that are in style everyone's buying for the farmhouse for their far farmhouse decor but this kind of reminded me of it because i can't find those those um jar those um glass vases nowhere and when i do find them they're really really expensive so that's why i'm going to wait on that and i'm going to try to get a deal on them because i really want them you know they're, they're called like demijohn they were used years ago for like wine, I think transportation and stuff like that. They were used in those like um, glass, you know, jars. It's kind of like the jar I showed you like this one, but really kind of big and yeah. So it's something like that. And everybody loves those um, 
those vases. They they use they really like those. jugs, but everybody's using them as um, vases. So yeah. So when I when I do find a good deal, I'm definitely buying because I love them. You know, you put flowers in there, you decorate. But just look it up. It's demijohn or something like that jars. You can go to Etsy or you can go to eBay and you can find real jars like that. They, they're they pretty expensive. They charge a lot. I think they're like original, you know, antique kind. But maybe I will. But let, anyway, I went to Home Goods and I picked this. This is really heavy and I just love it. And it was only $16.99 compared to all the other places that are like $100, $200. Even um, Pottery Barn has it for like $170. I don't even know, but... I was like, let me just get this just to start off. I just love it. So, yeah, and it's really heavy. And you put your flowers, and it's really, really pretty. It has a little, like, green tint to it. A lot of them do. Some have blue. Some have um, the green. And then, I, you know, I put these flowers from the Dollar Tree in here, which I thought looked pretty. And, yeah, look how pretty. So I picked up this jar, only $16.99, and it's really, really heavy and good quality. It's made in Spain in a recycled glass, so this is really, like, it's pretty good um, quality. All right, so these I picked up this weekend, and I just fell in love with them. I just love them. There's these two lanterns, and I got two of them because I'm going to put them on the side of my fireplace. Here, guys, I hope you guys can see. So you put a candle in the middle, but you could put anything. In the full time, I could put like a pumpkin and little acorns and stuff like that. When I when I saw this, that's what I thought of. And you could put a wreath on the top. So I just love them. They're a big size and um, <laughs> they were pretty cheap. Hold on. Yeah, they were $16.99 each, so you can't go wrong. You know, even Hobby Lobby, I looked for lanterns. They were like $50, so I think I did good. It's steel, you know, it's opened. I just like it because it looked like a farmhouse to me with that little um, loop on the top. Yeah, so, and I, I can even put those white candles in here. I can even put, there's too many things on this table. Yeah, and I can even put these white candles. Look how pretty it looks. And I just love it because the letters are vintage -y. And yeah, so I think this looks um, really, really cute. And that's how I'm going to display it on my fireplace, I think. You know, because I change my mind a lot. So, you know, I'm going to play around. So when you decorate your house, you should play around to see, you know, how it looks the best. You know, people, some people just put it there. I'm like, no, move it around, place it here, put something underneath it, and then, and then you know, like, wow, I like it like that. So you got to play around. Do not do not be scared to play around when you're decorating, you know, because we tend to do that, like, oh, no, just leave it. No, play around, and then you'll see how you like it, you know. Even if you place one little thing, it makes a whole difference. So anyway, I got these lanterns. I just love them. So I'm getting things so it's close. I'm going to start decorating. I think you guys are going to enjoy it. So... Wait, it's not, it's not over. I have, um, I think, two more things or three. Okay. So I picked this pillow. I just love it. I'm going with a lot of black and white, I think, for my family room. So I got kind of like a color scheme how I want it. So I got this black and white pillow. I like it. And um, it's very in. This, can, this is like kind of like, like boho, but you can incorporate boho with... Um, the country stuff I've seen a lot of girls do and Joanna Gaines is incorporating a lot of black this year so I was like yes because I love black and I seen her she had pillows something like this and I was like yeah I can incorporate I seen all the girls on Instagram they were doing all that so I was like yes I love it and I'm gonna do it so this pillow was I ripped it off I think it was $20 and this was the only one there and I just loved it and yeah this goes with um everything that um, I'm doing, you know, you can incorporate this. So yeah, and Target has a lot of black and white pillows and blankets, which I wanna go this weekend and see what they have. And I found this pillow that stood out to me and I picked it up. So yeah, it's and it's a really, really pretty guys. Yeah, it's like white stitch, it's really pretty. So I think it's gonna go nice with my decor. So I found that pillow, and that's the only one they had. That's what happens in home goods, is like, you, sometimes you can't find, like, the pair. But when I seen these lanterns, that's why I got it right away, because it was a pair. And I was like, yes. 
So, you know, sometimes it's hard to find. So when you find pear and you're looking for pear, pick it up if you're in the home goods. But this pillow, I don't really care because I can incorporate other pillows, you know, but. All right, and then, oh, oh, and then I found this gorgeous throw. This throw is so gorgeous. It's like, just look at it. I love the tassels in the bottom and it is so soft. This was $29.99, it was a little expensive. It's 100% cotton, but look at the beautiful detail. Like a quilt. Yeah, it just reminded me like a white quilt, which I love. You see, it's still country, farmhouse-ish, but it's white without all that farmhouse, you know, color. So yeah, so it reminded me of a quilt. So beautiful, 100% cotton, and it looks so pretty with my pillow. Yeah, so it was a little expensive, it was $29.99, but I just loved it, it was so soft, it was good quality, and it's cotton, and I think it's gonna look so great in my living room. So I picked that up, and I think I'm almost done. You know, I don't want it to be such a long video, I'm doing long videos with this um, these hauls. So, it's pretty big, I don't know if I can show you guys in the shot. Ooh, I wanna show you this. It's like a basket on wheels, which I love. Can you guys see here? So I picked up this basket and it has rope handles. I just loved it. And it has wheels and you can use this in your bathroom. You can use this in your um, family room, put all your, your blankets, your pillows. So I love this. So I gotta put it down because it's heavy. And I love it because it has wheels that you can you can wheel it around and push it around. You know, you could put your blankets, you could put your um, your towels in the bathroom. You could do a lot, a lot of stuff with this. Put kid toys, anything that you can imagine, you can do. So they had that in Home Goods. They had a bigger, bigger one. I didn't pick up the bigger one because it was a little expensive. And then they had a smaller one, so I got the medium size one. And let me tell you how much it was. I forgot. So that was twenty nine ninety nine. The big one, the big one was probably forty nine ninety nine. That's why I didn't pick it up. I probably thought it was like too expensive. So yeah. So that basket, and I think that basket looks so pretty. Even if I put that blanket and pillow in there. And all right. So that's it for my um, home goods um, farmhouse haul today. I hope you guys liked it and. So hopefully I can start um, decorating and showing you guys how I'm decorating the family room, farmhouse style. So hopefully soon. I hope you guys like these stuff. And let, and let me know down in the comments below what was your favorite piece that I picked up. And if you guys picked any pieces up or if you're going to start decorating a certain room, guys, let me yeah. know. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe. Hit the subscribe button right now so we can become friends and you can see my hauls and my DIYs. And if you like farmhouse style, give this video a thumbs up. Share my video. Tell a friend if anyone's interested in farmhouse decor. And I will see you in my next video. And I hope you always remember to keep designing life. Bye!